YouTube, football fans, shots fans, French Bertie fans, and anyone who stumbles across this video on the internet, welcome. Please, if you like the video, share, comment, show your friends, your sisters, your mothers, and anyone else. Today, I show you an insight on my life working in football as a member of staff. Football is a huge passion for many and also a release. I hope you enjoy finding out more about what goes on during the week for staff. I'm going to let the video roll, but I hope you enjoy and make sure to watch to the end. Check me out on twitch.tv forward slash French Bertie and all other socials. And apart from that, merci and thank you. Enjoy the video. Good morning, everyone. So I am just about to leave now for the EVB. I've brushed my teeth, I've got ready, showered, uh, the usual kind of morning routine. Um, so gonna go pick up my coffee, then go load the van and then head to Gordon School. So just a good morning for me. the shots. So I've uh, just opened up. I've got to get hold of the van keys now, which I have acquired. And I just need to pack some things onto the van and then head off to training. EBB, all locked up, van, all packed, time to hit the road. But I couldn't leave this morning without showing you the hallowed turf at the early hours of the morning. Look at that, silent but deadly. Just setting off for the morning, got my coffee, and in case I get caffeine deficient, because you all know exactly what I'm talking about. I also have a Monster Ultra. Calorie free monster energy. Calories are free. Uh, now we shoot off to Wooden School for the day ahead. Sales out the gate, safe and sound. Goodbye, EBB. See you later. Yeah, day. Right, so I've just got to Gordon's. Um, Robbie's now taking the van down the bottom, and I've taken everything into my treatment room. I just thought I'd let you guys embrace and enjoy the wonderful view. Now I'm into the office to get some work done. Uh, Tom and Coops are already working nice and hard. So uh, just say morning to everyone. Morning gents. Good morning. Just doing some analysis, getting ready for the day. I've just managed to grab Sam very briefly. So he's just gonna show you what he gets up to in the mornings and how vital and important his role is at the club. Hi there, so I'm just setting up the GPSs. So all the players have vests in different sizes and then there's a case of units here. Um, so all players have an individual pod with their number on it, I don't know if you can see. Um, so I'll put them in their correct sizes and then go and give them out to the players. They'll be turned on before training so we can track how much they're doing, how quickly they're running, uh, which links to their workload and performance. So that's what I get up to each morning. Very good, thank you Sam. Yes. Uh, you're probably noticing my hair's a little bit different. I did have a little shape up yesterday, so I'm obviously changing in between when I film. But this is the treatment room. So I've currently just set up ready for the students and everyone to come in for the morning. So yeah, this is where I work. Right, so just come down to breakfast. Uh, just gonna show you guys what's on offer. Bacon, porridge, toast, tomatoes scrambled egg, beans and mushroom. 
and then the boys will sit out here and they will just tuck in and enjoy themselves. Breakfast time was for breakfast. I'm having a couple of pieces of bacon. Yeah. Bacon. Bacon. And some beans. Nice. Beans and bacon. So I've just finished breakfast and I'm gonna go up to the treatment room now, sort out any treatments that are needed, do some strappings and then head back down and get myself set up. As we can see here guys, we've just got some of the players receiving treatment in the morning uh, by some of the students. Uh, soft tissue is optional. Um, we also have players doing some prehab or genuinely just having a little chit chat. I'm currently showing you just some of the strappings that I end up doing with the players. I have about uh, five to six ankle strappings along with extra bits and bobs that the players need depending on what the day has in, ha in store or depending on what the players are feeling like. After strappings and treatment in the morning, players are will look at the schedule and realize they've got a team meeting. This could either be just a breakdown of what happened on the weekend or from yesterday's training session. All right, everyone. So I've just finished doing the strappings and getting everyone ready for training. Uh, the boys are in a meeting now. So I'm walking down with my trusty box uh, to go and take the defib or the medical stuff onto the pitch. And then I'm gonna go into the sports hall to get ready for the prehab. So, walking over to the pitch. Obviously, it's lovely down here. It's a great little view. And everything's set up for training, warm up. All the drills have been set up and everything else is stored just to the side. Right around the school. And uh, here we're going to where prehab goes on. And uh, yeah, everyone's getting ready. Adam is leading prehab today, aren't you, Adam? Right, so now we've got the players warming up. Obviously, they can notice me being clowns. Um, just going to go around and keep an eye on Adam and Sam whilst they lead and take the warm up. Uh, it's about a eight to ten minute dynamic warm up. Lots of variety goes on here. Uh, change direction, rotation. We do some plyometrics and some explosive movements, and obviously just genuine ramp protocol. Right everyone, so we are now going through uh, some technical stuff. So I've got a rehab drill set up over here and the players are currently doing a technical drill. So I've got a couple of the injured players in there at the moment uh, who are able to do technical drills. Players are doing some stuff in the middle, some technical work. Goalkeepers over here. So here we have a drill where we're using some hurdles and some balls and cones. Got some plyometrics involved. Uh, players will dribble in between there and pass the ball or strike the ball into the back of the net. Um, and yeah, so we're just looking at jump, 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 claiming the ball, dribbling through and then striking. So, hello, over. 
Oh, the lens is a bit dirty. Is that better? Hmm, I think so. Right, I've set up a drill for Lewis today. So I hope this is a good angle. So we've got some hopping forwards and back, and he's got a pass up to the orange cone and follow through by running and then it'll change direction at the top. But hopefully we'll get a chance to show you in the video. And then I've got another dual set up just over here. I'll take you over here. <laughs> so we've got another dual set up here of dribbling and then there'll be bibs on the mannequins and he's got to react to the bib that I throw up in the air or put in the air instead of what I say or maybe point at. I totally understand you have watched me set up two or three drills and you have literally been shown neither of them. Sadly, I couldn't film as I got busy and distracted with other things. So here is a video of Kins working with Jordan. Just a simple passing drill, back and forth, increasing the range of passing. Training finished today. So we've currently got uh, Sammy doing RPEs and Adam is claiming GPS. Boys are just tidying up, and then some of the boys are doing some extras at the moment. I said to Georgia, like, so how was training today, Alf? Uh, training was good, thank you. Yeah, what was your RP? My RP was four today. Why? Uh, four because it was quite a light day. Um, started off with a nice light warm up, went into some sh uh, passing drills, then a shooting drill, and then finished with some set pieces. So, game tomorrow. Uh, looking forward to it. Training's finished. Time for some lunch. Adam's having some lunch. <laughs> and uh, let's uh, just show you guys what's on offer today. So, we've got Mediterranean pasta, some garlic bread, some veg and then the vegan option. And the boys are currently out in the wild. Jordan has finished lunch. We've got the wonderful Mitchell here, enjoying some lunch. How is it? It's good actually, yeah. So you what? Best garlic bread ever, ever. There we have it. Uh, this is Laura who looks after us. Laura gives a wave. <laughs> and then this is obviously where we have all of our lunch. Players will queue along here and then just go and sit out in the open. All right, time to go up to the office and finish off some emails and look at the stats from training. Uh, lunch is done, everything is done, kit's packed away. So just need to go up, sort out any other injured players who need some treatment. And then, like I said, just do some laptop time. So here is the staff just planning the next sessions and looking at tactical stuff in the afternoon. Right, just pulled up at the ground. I'm just gonna unpack with Clive and Ian and then sort a few bits and bobs out for training tomorrow and then just gonna shoot home. Need to unload everything from the van and take it inside. This is Clive, wonderful Clive, give us a wave. <laughs> So we take everything back to where we started and in. This is where we take everything after training into here. Right, day is finished. I'm just clambering into the motor. I am done. I'm not going to film myself driving out the EBB, but thank you for watching and hopefully you enjoyed. And that is it, football fans from across the world. Now it's your turn to help me by tagging, sharing, liking, commenting, and posting it somewhere for other football fans around the world to see. I'll try my utmost to now do a match day video. But for now, I hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for watching. French Bertie.